that. Wow. There's all kinds of other ways to do it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Is this, this the actual screenshot? Yeah. Like, um, it's, it's not like digital supplies or anything? But, and you're about to have the completion of the orbit. It's about to get completely in front of you. Wow. There it goes. It was not possible to see with the naked eye. Only at risk of your eyes. What do you mean, oh, yeah. oh, but what do you mean by the completion? Like, you mean like it's all the way in? It's all the way in, and it's not quite there yet. It's very close. To do what? What is it? Oh, it sorry. So, <laughs> so that you will have light behind it. You'll see it completely in front of the sun. Right now, light, light behind the sun? No, you'll see, you'll so see we're light, light on your back of on this side of it. Oh my gosh. The dot will be entirely within the sun. As it's moving this way. It's going to be coming across this way. For, until about like 8 o'clock or so? Is well, that it'll, it'll, you won't get to see it finish because it'll oh. settle set before it's done. Oh. It's going to be like here. Oh, you have to be in wow. Hawaii to okay, so see it. Oh, okay. okay. From, from second contact. Second contact. Okay, I like not knowing the name of that. How much? How much bigger than the disk there is? Huh? I fret if I walk I mean, over there to yeah. see a different view that I'm in. Um, you're not yeah. seeing the entire disk of the sun. You will be able to go online and get some lovely yeah, but photographs. Yeah, but still, I want to be able to like experience okay. it in the real. You know, no, I get so yeah. much better. Yeah. I'm just talking yeah. in terms yeah. of yeah. taking yeah. a picture. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. of course. Yeah. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> Is it safe to go check out some other cameras or shall I just stay here? Like, you said that it's going to go completely behind the sun and everything will light up. You want, you want to see it? Yeah, if I, if I go over there to a different place. It looks like it's going to happen really fast. Okay, I'll just wait here. And then you can see the glory. Yeah, of course. Through our scope. What do the other scopes look like? You can actually I mean, they look, 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 look at here, Oh, you could see some yeah. spots more. Oh, wow. And, so, and in, in actuality, if you were looking at telescopes coming in out here, down here. So you can actually see some spots with those. Uh -huh. okay. Why is it? Here it comes. Oh, my gosh. Oh, sorry. Sure. I would say... Not quite. It's officially in the It does look like, I mean, you just can't see the light all around the yet. That looks There you good. go. There you go. That yep. Pretty good. It did it on time. It did it on time. Wow. <laughs> Yay, it's Venus. It's nice to know that the heavens are predictable. <laughs> so this is how they calculated the size of the solar system. The size of the solar system. That's right. Wow. Well, they needed both sides. So but, but they they had other people in other parts of the world that yes. had synchronized their watches. How did they do that in the 17th century? That's I, what, is, so what exactly is it called? That is they, what is they, it uh, doing? Had right now, yeah. transiting. Well, okay. They got multiple, multiple um, as in the Julian and friends transit. If they observed both the beginning and the end, and then measured the time difference. Oh, okay. That's how they used it. And that, that's how they could determine the size of the size of the. What is it? Okay. So the, sorry. No. Oh, so it's. Well, I don't. Between the two. So this is what they were going after, but I, I couldn't find the math in the weekend that I was looking at this. So I, I, I wanted to actually take the data and plug it in just for fun to recreate the, the computation but I couldn't make it happen. Oh well. If you look in a history of math books, yeah. um like of angel. Well, I took a history of math class here yeah. and we discussed there were some formulas that they came up with, you know, in B C that were pretty pretty close, pretty close to yeah, like the orbit of the earth and and the, the how far away the planets were and stuff. Yeah. It was it was pretty amazing. So, this is gonna go off for us, so it's gonna go off for a second because a little fun adjustment is that it's limit. Okay. So I can't bring it on, so, so I need <laughs> sure. to actually spin it all the way over. And sure. Then move it over, so I'll go over there. Over. It's go so it's, 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 the, the Venus is actually like in front of the sun right now. In regards to like you know, it's but it's there. Clo closer to it. Yeah. Uh, it's right. It's how 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 is the sun? The, so is Venus really, 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 really hot right now? Like, exactly. No, it's, it's all it's, it's, just, it's just like it's closer to the sun though, right? Or no? It, it, I don't I don't it's understand. It's very hot, hot, always. Okay, but is it any more hotter than it usually is? No. There's, okay. It's at the same distance as it normally is. It's just yeah. orb orbit. Okay. You have, you have the sun. Okay. And then and then Venus.
Venus and Earth. Venus always does this. Normal, nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then what's happened is we've gotten we've gotten kind of like that. Oh, okay. So it's we're all in the same position of our orbit. Okay. Are you taking pictures of my hands? No, no. Oh. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that's all. Okay. That's how it works. Okay. The, the uh, cloud Great. Coming over. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, well, yeah. Yeah. Are we getting to see more or less of it? I mean, sorry, uh, in relation to us rotate, rotating. We're rotating because I guess I could imagine it being one of two ways. Either we get to see more or less of it, right? Wait, you mean from now? Yeah. From now until the future? Or no, from now or during the passage. During the passage, right? Because if we're rotating this way, then we're scanning across it quickly. But if we're rotating the opposite way, we would stay in line with the computer in our Oh, 
Well, I've seen it many times. <laughs> it depends on where it is in its orbit. And uh, when you see it in the sky and it's luminous, will it be more than a crescent? Well, it depends on when, where it is in its orbit. So yeah. If you would have looked at it in March, uh -huh. it was incredibly bright. You would have seen that it wasn't a crescent. It was half lit and more than half lit. Okay, so it's just a matter of two months that you miss, you miss seeing that. Mm -hmm. Now it's not as impressive when it's not expressive. It's not as bright. It's bright, but it's not as impressive. It looks not as pretty. <laughs>